But now, now when you because you tried that, I have tried that. You know, I've tried, a few I, months ago when yeah, I met you. Yeah. I thought you were dog for asking me that, but that's, that doesn't matter. No, that was me. I, I never asked taking advantage of. I never friendship. asked. That's okay. Yeah. But that's all right. I'm gonna ask now, though. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna ask now. What now? Is yeah. Tony dead? I think he's. <laughs> I, you know what? I think he's dead. Do you? And I watched it with. Um, it was on a couch, and right. here's Jim Gandolfini, Tony Sirico, me, okay. Stevie Van Zant, Steve Sharippa plays Baccarat, right. Michael Imperioli. We were put in this room in Florida if we had done a big appearance, and they let us watch it alone. And I, me, I say he's dead. Yeah? Yeah. Now, you, you, we've, we spoke before, and you told me that, now even you, Gandolfini, mm -hmm. had no idea of the ending. Right? No, no. Now, you watching it at 9 o'clock, like we yes. watched it at nine o'clock. It's the same exact. Thing. It was the same That's thing. That's amazing. Yeah, you no, guys I'm saying no clue. We did a personal appearance in Hollywood, Florida, right. at the Seminole Hard Rock, and we had I did a little over nine thousand people outside, and we had eight hundred inside that we had to do pictures with, and dinner, and a private uh, a private party they had us do for an hour, and so on and so forth. But at five to nine, our business manager Roger Haber, who travels with us, shut everything down. And they put us in a room, maybe triple this size. We oh, so you're alone, the cast. Just okay. cast only. Okay. And we watch this. And, you know, we're sitting there like this. You know, and we're on the show. Yeah. And we've been on the show for a long time. And we go, what? Why? And then we look at the other <laughs> and say, no, why did he cut it that way? Why did David edit this? With it? So it was all a revelation. But if you notice, when you, the camera came in, mm -hmm. it was really Jimmy's POV, Tony Spano's POV. I mean, he's looking at an empty booth. Now he's looking here. Now he's looking there. Everything was his point of view. Right. The two guys who shot him, the two actors who shot him a couple of years ago, were sitting in a diner, as was someone else from his past. And who was that? Who crossed paths with him. That was the guy that was sitting at the cat. Right. Who, in season five, near the end of season five, was seeing with some people who never had a good word to say about Tony Soprano. Now, is he a killer? We don't know, but yeah. I'll give you something else. Okay. If you look at Meadow park, trying to park the car and eventually mm -hmm. coming in that door, right. if you look at the distance between where the family was sitting in the booth and the distance of where the door is, they do what's called a smash cut. It's a, a hair second of him looking up. Meadow could never have gotten to his seat well, quickly enough for him to look straight up at someone. He'd be looking like this, wouldn't he? 